In this video, we will see how to fix Windows Update Error Code 0xc1900223 on Windows 11 and Windows 10. If you are also facing such type of Windows Update Error Code, fail to install Windows Latest Update, then here are the fixes. And the first workaround is right click on a Start button and choose Settings. Here from the left side, go to System Settings, click on System. Thereafter, from the right side, choose Troubleshoot. So scroll down and you will find the option Troubleshoot. Click on it. Here, click on other troubleshooters. Here, you will find the option Windows Update Troubleshoot. Click on Run button and let the window complete the troubleshooting process. Follow on screen instruction to complete the process. It will not only detect the issue, prepare them accordingly. So, wait for some time. It will take few seconds and after that, check whether your Windows Update Error Code resolved or not. If not, go to the next fixes. The next fixes is right click on a start button and choose run. Here in run dialog box, type services.msc. Click on OK. This command will open services windows in your system. And in services windows, three to four windows update related services, you will have to start or restart. And the first one is background intelligent transfer service. Right click on it and choose first start. If you already found it in a start mode, then choose restart. Thereafter, apply a double click on it to open its properties and set a startup type as automatic. And finally, click on apply and OK to save the changes. The second one is Cryptographic services. I scroll down and you will find cryptographic services. Same process, right click on it and choose a start, otherwise, restart it. Thereafter, apply a double click on it to open its properties and set a startup type as automatic. And click on apply and OK to save the changes. The third one is Windows installer services. I scroll down and under W alphabet, you will find Windows installer services. Same process, right click on it and choose start, otherwise, restart it. Apply a double click on it to open its properties, but you can't change its startup type, so close the windows. And the last one is Windows update services. Same processor, right click on it, choose start, otherwise, restart. Apply a double click on it to open its properties and say it a startup type as automatic and click on apply and OK to save the changes. After that, restart your system and check whether your Windows update error code resolved or not. If not, go to the next fixes. Go to Windows search and type CMD and open command prompt Windows run as administrator mode. Choose run as administrator. In command prompt windows, execute the command as shown on the screen. First, execute this three DISM tool one by one, followed by enter key on each time. DISM online scan help, DISM online check help, and DISM online restore help. Execute all these three commands in command prompt windows one by one, followed by enter key on each time. And one successfully execution of DISM tool, execute the command SFC scan now. Type SFC slash scan now and press enter. It will scan your PC for any corrupted or bad system files. Wait till 100% verification complete. After that, restart your system and check whether your system Windows update error code resolved or not. If not, go to the next fixes. Go to Windows search and here type this cleanup. Open this cleanup. Click on open. And here, select the drive you want to clean up. Basically, where your program files exist, C drive, and a new this cleanup wizard windows will open. Here, under files to delete, make the check against recycle bin, temporary files, downloaded program files. Make the check against all these options and click on OK. Are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? Choose delete files. And after that, Close the windows and check whether your Windows Update error code resolved or not. If not, go to the next fixes. 
again go to windows search and here type cmd and open command prompt windows run as administrator mode click on run as administrator and in command prompt windows execute these three da these three windows update components these four first to stop these four services execute all these four command one by one followed by enter key on each time in command prompt windows to stop these four services and thereafter these windows update components execute one by one followed by enter key on each time all this command path will also available in my videos description box you may copy from there simply one by one copy and paste it in command prompt windows and press enter on each time once Windows update component successfully execution. I start all those four services. You have earlier stopped them. Now execute this comma four commands one by one to stop start all those four services. Once successfully execution of Windows update components, restart your system and check whether your Windows update error code resolved or not. If not, go to the next fixes. Right click on a start button and choose settings. Here from the left sidebar of setting space I scroll down and click on windows update and here I scroll down and click on update history and here go to one by one installed windows updates make sure that all updates are successfully installed if you found any updates not successfully installed in your system note the that kv update and note the kv update that have not been successfully installed in your system and go to your google chrome browser and manually download and install that kv update on your system in google chrome browser type microsoft update catalog open microsoft update catalog and here open it microsoft update catalog and in search field of microsoft update catalog type the desired kv update which you want to download and install and fail to install or having error code and click on search all its related updates will visible here manually click on download button and manually download and install windows latest update on your system that's all.